Hi! Good morning and welcome to another episode of The Studio. My name is Adam and it's time for yet another Let's Watch! Welcome back to the show once again. If you haven't already, hit that red subscribe button below to keep up with my uploads. I'm still making weekly content every single week. It's been really nice to keep making videos for all of you. And I'm also working on, well, I'm trying to release seven pieces <laughs> by the end of this year, but we'll see how we go. I'm still working on the first one, which is going to be a chorale. But I'm also heading to Taiwan in less than two months for the Taiwan International Percussion Convention. Remember this video, the one about 100 marimbas? Yeah, that's happening again. So I'm going to be really excited to see that and present a few classes and all that kind of stuff. So today we're going to be watching some marching videos because we still have a lot of marching submissions on the Let's Watch Marching section at antipercussion.com forward slash discord. That's our discord server if you want to submit any content to the Let's Watch channel. Submit it there. First submission, Imperial. Is that Imperial like Skyrim Imperial? This was my marching head camp for this last season at Woodbridge High School. It was a lot of fun. Unrelated, but I'm lucky enough to be taught by one of Adam's favorite silo players, Michael Tran. Remember Michael Tran? That was like a very, very good era. But yes, we have a Woodbridge High School Center Marimba Cam. I haven't watched a high school Marimba Head Cam for a while, so I'm going to give it a shot, especially because this is Michael Tran's student. I think the person's name is Ryan. So uh, let's watch. Okay, so here's the opening shot. I can see we've got a. Well, this looks like a. Is this a, is this a Paduke Marimba? Is it a synthetic? Oh no, it's a synthetic. Yeah, it's got the holes in the bars. And on the right hand side, we've got a. Symbols lying on the floor. <laughs> That's very interesting. I've never seen symbols mounted on the floor before. Um, and this looks like a very fancy place to rehearse. So yeah, you could never get stuff like this in a high school in Australia. Like a whole line of marimbas, like a whole front ensemble of marimbas, drums, everything. Like you'd be lucky to get one marimba at a high school here. So nice. <laughs> Alright, so this is what they meant by daps. A little bit of the handshake, a little shake of the sauce bottle. Alright, with your drum major. Mallet shake. Yeah. Another <laughs> mallet shake. Yeah. Okay. Wow, that's really nice grip. <laughs> that's really nice grip. <laughs> Damn, okay. Uh, nice beating positions. It does look like sometimes the mallets are going a little bit too far in for the exit. Whoa, that was nice. Wow, great lateral work. With the K's. Let's go, battery. Uh, 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 uh. Great placement. Look, look at the look at the look at the turning of the elbow. Really nice. And then keeping the balance as straight as possible. Really great. Working that right hand into that interval. Really, really nice. Oh, that changeover was so nice. Oh, let's go. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> pretty high accuracy. Very nice. Alright, pick up the case. Let's go. Those symbols are more expensive than all the symbols in my studio combined. Oh. I love how they're all looking at Ryan being like, tell us when to crash. <laughs> what? <They're> just... <laughs> just chuck the symbols on the floor. Now I see why we have symbols on the floor. No space for racks, I'm guessing. Oh, look at that octave! Very nice! Woo! I love that Ryan is moving up and down with the instrument. Oh, uh, interesting scare run. <laughs> Alright, back to two. Great finger work. Look at that, look at that height! Look at that height! Oi! Woo! Someone's practicing their single stroke, bro. Look at that. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> I just had a roll it. <laughs> That's great. Big roll, big roll. Nice. Nice. Excellent. 
Now, we go back to the regular four. Oh, I like this, I like this scale. This sounds like an early K-pop song from the 2000s. I like the natural lilt that Ryan's got in his playing. Steady, no rushing, it's great. Yeah. This ladder is so clean. Just, just looking at that rotation makes me feel so satisfied. <laughs> mm. Oh, nice. Oh, look at that left hand. Okay. Oh, that was nice. I like the triple A conversion. Really nice. Oh! Tiffany always gonna spoil the fun. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Alright, symbols off the floor, let's go! That's an uh, interesting way of holding symbols. I'm no simple expert, but I feel like you could turn it more side on, maybe? Interesting. It's amazing how groups like this memorize so much material. Like, this is like a 10 minute piece, essentially. Nice. Duck, 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 duck. Oh, softer balance, interesting. Oh, oh, that, oh, that modulation though. The slow rise up and down. Oh, the spin. I saw the spin. This is an F major scale, everybody. Oh, some wrong notes there. Some wrong notes. This is such a nice symbol. Nice. Very good. Interesting simple technique. Interesting simple technique. But, yeah. Oops. Okay, but seriously, Ryan, it's a really, really good cam that you got there. Your grip is actually really satisfying to watch. I love the lateral work. I love your placement. I love that you're moving up and down with the instrument so freely. The book itself is okay. Still pretty difficult, even for a high school level. There's a lot of complicated scale runs in there that kind of just appear at random times. The mallet changes were so swift and everything was just really fluid. So really, really well done. The symbol grip, that was really interesting how the symbols were kind of, you're holding the symbols kind of like almost vertical and then you're trying to like crush it like that based on what I can see in the video. It might be the angle of the camera, but it just looks a little bit more difficult than it should be. Like generally speaking, most people I've seen play symbols more on a, like a 45 degree angle. Like, it's just interesting because if you want to get a big crash and you have one that's like not fully flat, it's really hard to get it like to actually land in the right place. So that was a bit interesting. Also the fact that there's no cradles and they're just kind of like lying on the floor. I mean, cradles are pretty expensive, so fair enough. Really, really amazing to watch this. Thank you so much, Ryan, for sharing your head cam with us. Let me know down in the comments below what you thought of Ryan's performance. And if you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. Our next video is from Cade and it's Matrix 2015 Mine. Not Taylor Swift Mine. <laughs> Matrix. <laughs> Matrix is a world-class ensemble that focuses on the more artistic side of WGI. So we haven't really seen many WGI videos in the past couple of weeks just because I haven't received many <laughs> in the submissions. But this is a good one. The show is mine from 2015 and it's based on love. Fun fact, the couple at the end is a real couple and up till their finals run, the proposal was fake. But as it says, this time it's for real. Oh, so they actually proposed? Oh, that is really cool. This is right up there with that show where the uh, drum major gets stabbed. You remember that one? What was it? Spartacus. That's right. The drum major gets that like there's just some sort of like breaking the fourth wall content and I'm really excited to see this. if there's actually a proposal at the end of this that's gonna be 
pretty awesome. Uh, let's watch. Okay, here's the video, and as we can see, this is one of those professional multi-cam videos. And wow, this is a very packed stadium. I haven't seen packed stadiums like this. Well, I guess it's all because of COVID and stuff, but this is great. Okay, so I'm really interested to witness this uh, live proposal thing. I'm guessing it happens right at the end. Let's go. Presenting their program, mine, WGI Sport of the Arts. Oh, sounds like the start of an NBA game. <laughs> so poppy. This one is mine. Oh, the drums coming off the floor like that. That's sick. A human snare drum stance. That's as good as it gets. Is that never going to give you up? Woo, that's so cool. Never seen human snare drum stands before. That's a first for me. Oh, do the human drum stands get paid extra? Because that's a lot of work. Hey, very nice. Actually, holding a snare drum like that for ages is very tough, very tiring. Oh, look at this! Look at this battery! Look at that! Very good snaps. I missed the visual aspect of WGI, it's awesome. Wow, 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 Bruba, okay, wow, okay. Oh, 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 oh. This, this groove is so good. I can't stop thinking of Rick Astley every time I hear this chord pattern. Oh, look at those rotations. Oh, beautiful. Very nice hits. Oh, that person has green hair, that's so sick. Woo! I love the build up. I love the fire. Look, everyone's really determined to hit. That's awesome. Oh. Someone's name? Oh, mine, right. <laughs> I was like, Mia? <laughs> that's mine, okay. What happened? Oh. Oh! Oh, okay. Is this the couple that proposes? Oh, wonderful. Okay. I was gonna say, it'd be pretty awkward to, to kiss someone random, so... <laughs> Ooh, look at this. Oh, amazing tennis. Alright, here we go. Wow, with the leg over the top. Wow, that's cool. That's cool. Oh, I love the flow of it, it's so awesome. Oh, oh, with the side steps. Oh, very tight, very tight snaps, I like that. Pit is going off. Oh, look at this line that they've made. Nice, very nice. Oh, I didn't realize John Mayer was in the building. <laughs> Waiting on the world to change. <laughs> I always find it so interesting, these like poppy drop grooves with these like very marimba-y style parts played over the top. That intersection is so interesting to me. Nice. Oh, spinning cymbals. Freely spinning cymbals on the floor, that's pretty sick. Oh, oh, I would feel so much anxiety throwing cymbals like that. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, this bass split though. Oh yeah, that's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. There's like so many little nuggets of interest in this. Wow, this is very fast river bars, very, very fast. Nice. Very satisfying. Oh, another kiss. Another kiss. So it wasn't that couple. Is this the couple that proposes? Maybe the other one is a real. They, oh, no, no, there's, there's a few of them. Maybe some of them are real and some of them aren't. Interesting. 
interesting. Oh yeah, they take photos of themselves with the 2015 era phone camera. That's pretty sick. Wow, there's so many people. There's so many people that aren't with instruments. The color gun, I'm getting more like, yeah. This is Alyssa, and she is mine. Tonight, this is for This real. is for real. Oh! Oh, wow. This is an actual proposal? What? <laughs> what? Is that allowed? <laughs> That's so awesome. What? What? Oh, that's so wholesome. Did I get extra points for that? <laughs> oh, that's sick. The box is on the floor. Oh, that's so sick. Actual proposal. Matrix from Ecuador, Actual proposal. Ohio, under the direction of Rob Ferguson. Wow. The feels though. That is so interesting. I wonder if like, I mean, it's obviously very cool and I can see in the comments that apparently this couple is still going, where is it? Something you would never expect. How's this couple doing now? We're great. Seven year wedding anniversary in May. That is so interesting having something like that. It, it like breaks the 4-4, but it's still kind of within the context of the performance. So I suppose it's all right, but it's also just like, did I get marked differently? <laughs> because it's like kind of not part of the performance, but it kind of is like, because they would have had to, I don't know, shed the visuals a little bit because it's a bit more of an authentic, not choreographed movement. But at the same time, imagine being proposed to at something like WGI where both of you have been working on it for like a whole, however long it is, like a year or something. And then you come together and then the thing is about love and it's in front of all these people. And it's both like a public and a private experience at the same time. And there were just so many like ebbs and flows, like the marimba sections where they rippled in with these like ridiculous lateral runs and then the battery features all really cool the bass splits very nice and i guess this performance is a reminder to us that music is able to convey so many emotions so many meanings so many intents each one of the people in the group have their own stories and today two of them share their story together on stage that is just so cool <laughs> so yeah let me know down in the comments below what you thought of matrix 2015 mine and if you enjoyed today's video, please give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. So if you have any more suggestions like that, hit them up in adamtampercussion.com forward slash discord. Submit it under Let's Watch Marching, Let's Watch Concert, whatever is applicable to you. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I'll see you next week for another episode of The Studio. Good night. Better.